We are gonna try some treats from a local Italian bakery, but first have lunch with me. We went out for pizza, so I have leftover cold pizza, which I love cold pizza. One slice is cheese and one is mushrooms and green, or I wanted green olives, they didn't have that. Mushrooms and black olives. And then we had a feta salad. We asked for extra feta and they gave us two big chunks like this. I love when there's big chunks in the feta salad or in a Greek salad. Most places that I've seen locally just do the crumbled feta, which is amazing too. Feta is feta and I love feta, but the big chunks, they just hit different. They really do. They had um, chili flakes and parmesan, so we put that on all the slices. But it's funny, you get used to eating pizza a certain way. Like I love pizza with ranch and hot sauce, some sort of hot sauce, but they didn't have either. So it's like my pizza felt naked. <laughs> That's a little more ranch than I intended to put, but I'm sure it'll be delicious. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna dip some of the second slice in there. Look, my feta has eyes. This is so good, you guys. It's so comforting and yummy and cheesy. I hope you're all having a really good day and that you have something really yummy to nourish your body and your soul. For me, today that's pizza. So this is the first one that caught my eye. This is like a cream cheese croissant. Look at it. It smells amazing. It has that kind of apricot glaze. You see the cream cheese? So we're gonna cut a piece for us to try or for me to try and then the rest of everything is gonna go to my mom. <laughs> it's really good. The pastry is so flaky and so buttery and rich. And my mom loves cheese danishes. This is amazing. The cheese is super creamy too. I'm not sure if it's cream cheese or whether it's a different cheese they use, but it's so good. 10 out of 10. Next up is this fruit tart. I was gonna say fruit tart, fruit danish. It's either an apple or an apricot glaze on top, but it smells so good, you guys. My mom always, use, oh, almonds. My mom always used to love the fruit danish or fruit tart. I'm gonna leave the fruit part intact for her, but I'm gonna try a little bit like this. Mm -hmm. The glaze on top is flavorless, but it really, really complements the pastry and the creamy custardy feeling. This one's so good. And the sliced almonds inside work so perfectly. This is magical. I give it 8.5 out of 10, only because I'm more of a chocolate person than a fruit person. I love fruit, but not in my dessert. But if you like fruit in your dessert, it'd be 10 out of 10. Last up, their chocolate croissant. It smells really buttery and flaky and yummy. I use kitchen scissors instead of a knife to cut it and it worked beautifully. Look at that powdered sugar. <laughs> mm -hmm. That might be my favorite. They're all super good though. I think the first one and the third one are tied for my favorite. Buttery flaky pastry, absolutely delicious. It's another 10 out of 10.